So today I want to talk to you about the Hoover Power Scrub Elite Shampoo Machine. So now I did a video recently about the Rug Doctor, which I love, absolutely love, you know, for deep cleaning, things like that. However, I got this one, you know, for touch-ups or for maybe once a month of shampooing carpets. So um, I'm going to be playing some videos of doing some shampooing. I did go over one of the areas that I did in the previous video with the Rug Doctor, which did a fantastic job of pulling out even more dirt from the carpet, which I was shocked. So I'm going to tell a little bit about the machine. It is dual action. It's got the scrub brushes on the bottom. I love it. It actually did a great job. Now, in the other machine that I have, you know, it just has like a brush that goes back and forth and these brushes spin. So this really did a good job at, you know, picking up, scrubbing the carpet and picking up some more dirt and really refreshing the carpet. It's kind of old carpet in this house. So with that being said, let me talk about the upper bucket. In the upper bucket that I have right here, you're going to have a part right here that you put the water, that you put the water in. And on the other side, you're going to put the solution. And it's interesting because in some of the shampooers, put the shampoo in and the water and it all mixes together, right? So in this one though, you put it in here and on the machine, when you start to spray, you can either turn this dial right here, this dial, you could turn it to wash or to rinse. So it's going to be on wash when you're going to be shampooing the carpet, which is great because then you don't have to go dump it out, refill it with clean water and then rinse the carpet. It's just like with your hair, when you wash your hair and then you want to rinse it out, rinse out all the shampoo. It's the same concept. So with this, once you're done washing or shampooing the carpet, once you're done with it on wash, you're going to turn it to rinse right there see right there on rinse and then you're just going to squeeze the trigger and rinse over that section then when you go back to another section then you can go ahead and put it back to wash and wash the carpet and it's great now for the lower bucket the lower bucket right here is the collection bucket and this is what collects all your dirty water and this right here has a little tab right here on this on the well, it's on the back. It has a tab on the back that you can open this and dump all your dirty water into the toilet. I wouldn't dump it into the sink because it might clog the sink. So, or you can take this part down right here and open it up and just dump it out and clean it out and everything. Cause you know, after a few times they'll get really dirty and then you want to clean it out, clean out the whole thing. It's really a great unit. Now it does come with a hose as well to do those, you know, stairs or, you know, corners or edges that you can't reach when you're actually doing your shampooing. So that tank is an auto mix tank that I was talking about. And the wash rinse mode, that's something also important to keep in mind. I know there's a lot of units that don't do it this way, but this one does. Now it does have heat force technology. So when you do push forward, and I like that about this unit because in my rug doctor, you cannot push it forward. And then, you know, as you're shampooing, you have to tilt that back and wheel it forward and then shampoo as you're pulling back when it's sucking up all the dirty water. So in this, when you're pushing forward and you're squeezing the trigger, you're releasing the shampoo and it's scrubbing the floor. And when you pull back, it's sucking up all of the dirty water. That's what I like about this unit. So this is great for actually doing touch-ups once a month or doing bedrooms or, you know, living rooms, things like that, or just the high traffic areas. The brushes are antimicrobial spin brushes. And that's really good to know because, you know, in this day and age, I'm telling you, we track so much dirt in the house and it's unfortunate, but lately I've gotten to the point of, you know, taking shoes off. So, um, I love it. I'm going to keep using this unit. I think it's amazing. I think it's great. And it's something that I'm going to use probably um, every once a month to do a freshen up and to do the high traffic areas. Now, it does say that you could enjoy dry carpets in 45 minutes. However, I did go over these sections several times. The carpet was still a little damp. 
but I did put high velocity fans on the carpets and by the next day they were dry. I just wouldn't recommend vacuuming or anything until after you're sure they're completely dry. The hose that comes with it is an eight foot hose and it comes in a nice bag. It's really, really great. And the accessories too, with the different brushes and so forth. Now the bag that comes with the accessories is right here. It's a very well made bag. It has a hook up here so you can hang, you can hang this up on a doorknob or in a closet. I have it hanging on a doorknob um, just because I've been using the shampoo a lot. So you can see there's a mesh netting here. And this netting is in case you have anything in here that might be a little bit damp. Therefore, the air gets in there, so it snaps together. This one's got a rubber uh, rubber brushing right here, so you can scrub really, really hard, you know, and suck up all the dirt. That's a good one. This one right here has a soft green bristle brush. Um, I guess you could use that for stairs or upholstery or upholstery, I'm not sure. Um, this is another attachment that can go on, oops. <laughs> this is another attachment that can go on uh, here as well. Oh, and here's one of the corner tools. This is really good too. Now this will just suck up all the dirt, but this is a good corner uh, edging tool to use uh, on the attachment. And of course in the bag is your eight foot hose and you put your attachment right here. So I have not used this yet. I was actually using the shampooer itself. Um, you know, like I said, there's been a lot of high traffic areas in the house and they do get dirty over the years. And I think this price point for this machine is great because it saves you a lot of money. You have to do the work yourself. But if you were to call a professional out to do it, then it's going to cost a lot more money because I tried to have somebody come out a, uh, um, a, a name brand, you know, company that was going to come out. But unfortunately, their quote was a little bit high. So at, a, what was it, a little over $100 I was on a special. I got the unit and therefore you can save hundreds. And then you can pull it out whenever you want and shampoo your carpets to your heart's design. And that's something that I really enjoy. It is a lot of work, but at the end of the day, it's worth it for me. So I really enjoy it. Now it does say the brushes are 360 degree brushes and I do like the fact that they spin continuously as they're scrubbing the carpet. The suction on here is great. It is a lightweight machine. I'm trying to think of anything else I can think of. Um, when I used it, I really enjoy it. It's got a long cord. Now, if I was to go to another room, yes, I do have to switch the cord. I can't, I can't have to plug it into another room. I can't just drag it across the whole house, but that's okay. That's not really a problem. But I would recommend that if you were going to do something like this or any shampoo, make sure that you get enough bottled shampoos at the store because it comes, I think this one came with a tiny bottle, like a couple ounces. And that does work on, um, I don't know, maybe a couple hundred square feet. However, I just want to make sure that I had a lot more available for, you know, doing some more carpets. And it's just, it's just great for doing high traffic areas. So, boy, I should have done a live on this so I could have had a question and answer session because I can't think of anything else. Um, with this unit that I really wanted to say, but actually it's just a really great unit. Uh, like I said, I do love my other shampooer, but for like a very deep, deep cleaning, uh, this seemed to do very well, even in the area that I did after I used my other unit. And this really took out a lot of dirt, a lot of dirty water. So I was pretty happy about that. I'm very satisfied with it. And I'm going to have more reviews and videos on these units coming up as soon in the coming months because we're doing a lot of house cleaning and trying to get things in order. So I hope that everyone enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing for more videos like this. I hope everybody is having a nice uh, fall as we're going into it now and winter, or is it winter? 
it might be winter it is kind of cold so uh with that being said i hope you guys have a nice day and i will see you next time <laughs>